Hello my lovelies, it's Heather here and I'm going to be doing a video on the Benefit Boxed Blushes. I have quite a few so I thought I would compare them and talk about them. But first before you do anything, make sure you click below and you watch this in HD so you can get better quality. Alright, now let's get started. So the first one I ever got was Benefit Throb. Um, and it's like a pink, I'm not sure if they sell this anymore. It's it's a, a light pink with shimmer and you know the top comes off it has a little tray with a brush in it but it's just this really pretty light pink color it smells delicious and it has a little, um, flex of shimmer in it so I'll swatch it that's the pink for Benefit Throb the next one I have is Sugar Bomb uh, this came out like maybe last year year before but it was one of their newer ones and again the top came comes off oops I just dropped it and it has a little tray with a brush and it's got this 4x color kind of four different colors it smells just like <clears throat> smells just like throb so this is what it looks like swatched it's a nice, pretty, it's more of a peachy tone than um, Throb. Throb's pink, this is like a peachy kind of color. Then the next one I, well, I guess I should have done this before Sugar Mom, but the next thing I have is called Powder Rosy, and I got this at Ulta one time. I don't remember, it was a couple years ago. But I've seen another kind of this too that was older, but it comes with Hula, Coralista, and Dallas. So you just pop the top off and it's four little squares. I got this because I wanted to try out Benefit Blushes and it comes with a mini brush. The top here we have Hula, which is their bronzer color. Benefit Bronzer and it's very, very smooth. That's, that's what Dallas looks like. When I'm swatching them on my hand, I'll show you at the end. And it's so smooth and matte and I love the smell of these. Then the bottom right here under Dallas is Coralista, and it's obviously a coral color. And this is what Coralista looks like, kind of similar to Sugar Bomb, but it's a lot more hot and pigmented. And at the bottom here we have Dallas. And Dallas is like a, hmm, how would I describe it? It's kind of like Hula, but it's more got like a more of a pink mix into it, and it's got some shimmer. That's what Dallas looks like. It's like a rose, a dusty, dusty rose color. So that's those, and you can get these in the full size, obviously. Then, then I have Bella, Bella Bomba, and this is when, like, it's Benefit started to evolve their packaging. So this is like a, it's supposed to be called a 3D blush, that's why the packaging is very metallic. But Bella Bomba, the top just flips open. It doesn't come off, and it comes with a mirror. I don't want to blind you, but it comes with a mirror up top. The brush is also a little bit different. This brush is rounded, whereas the other ones were square. And I'll compare all three at the end, because there's three different kinds of brushes. So Bella Bomba is just this bright, deep pink color, and it's got lots of shimmer. And that is what Bella Bomba looks like very very pretty and it's um it's a lot brighter than it's a lot brighter than throb it's kind of like got some coral in it almost but it's a it's a hot pink so that's what bella bomba looks like and this was this came out last year then finally the newest blush that benefit has come out with is called hervana and this is supposed to be a um a matte blush and again it has the flip open lid with the mirror and this brush is actually angled and this is what Hervana looks like it's like a pinwheel really really pretty and I'm wearing Hervana today because it has become one of my favorite blushes but you can just swore all colors together and you get this really pretty light pink it's actually hard to swatch because it's so light, but it comes out really, really, really like pretty on your cheeks. So that's Hervana. 
So starting from the top, it's Throb, Sugar Bomb, Dallas, Coralista, Hula, Bella Bamba, and then on the side here is Urbana. So that's all. So this is what the first generation of brushes looked like. And they're like these square heads. They're soft, but they're like a hint of scratchiness. I don't know, I can't describe it. It's not really scratchy, but there's just something. So then the next thing that came with Bella Bamba is this round, rounded one. And this is very soft. It's a lot softer than the first kind. And the wood is a lot smaller, like the brush part. Then finally, we have the Hervana brush, which is like a tapered fan, like it goes up and it's extremely, extremely soft and really nice. So this is what the brushes have evolved from. This to this to this, 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 okay. And as you can see, the wood got smaller and the brush, they just improved. They've only improved so much so yeah they've improved a lot on their um, their brushes so I really really love benefit boxed blushes they are a little pricey they're $28 but like I said if you keep your eyes open for the sets which I got mine at Ulta around I think around the holidays like the Powderazzi these are a great deal because you get a lot of product and you can try out multiple colors at once and I think that was like Maybe that was $28 or 19 I know it's a really big difference in price, but it was it was um, either around the price of one single blush or less. I think it was less, but it was just an awesome deal. So keep your eyes open for those because they're a great way to try out Benefit Blushes if you're looking to try them out. So if you have any questions, please feel free to comment below and don't forget to subscribe if you like my videos and want to see more. So thanks for watching. Bye everyone.